Matt Miles, let's talk about the San Francisco 49ers here for a little bit. So recently reported, according to ESPN's Adam Schefter, that the 49ers have officially given quarterback Jimmy Garoppolo permission to seek a trade this offseason. This coming on the heels of Jimmy Garoppolo uh, being reported to be fully cleared mid-August. That was according to Ian Rappaport. So a lot of news about Jimmy Garoppolo, you know, finally becoming fully healthy and being on the market. A lot of uh, ramifications there and where he could end up playing this season or, or when he could leave the 49ers. Uh, but before we get into that a little bit, 49ers fans, comment below. Uh, when do you think uh, Jimmy Garoppolo will be traded? If he does get traded or if he gets cut, let us know. Is it going to be a training camp, preseason, sometime during the season? Let us know in the comments below what you think. But Maya, what do you think on this issue with the 49ers and Garoppolo? So I think it's interesting that uh, Garoppolo now, uh, after the surgery, after he's starting to get cleared to practice, getting cleared to play a little bit, cleared to throw, uh, now they've allowed him to seek a trade partner. And I think this is going to be very interesting. It's almost no one's going to trade for him because they would have already probably done it. But what they're going to do is maybe gauge interest and throw his name out there. I think the big thing, like we said, is if somebody goes down in training camp, preseason, regular season, the first quarterback to go down, uh, where are you going to look, Nick? The only option right now is Jimmy G. So in a way, obviously I think the 49ers would have liked to have traded him away as early as possible in the season, you know, got one of those big blockbuster trades like for Russell Wilson or the likes of something like that. But now they held on through everything and now they're the only option. So if something happens, now people are going to have to come to them and they kind of hold all the cards rather than or the other teams holding the cards being able to uh, talk about what they want. So in a way, it's kind of worked out for them to hold on to Jimmy G for so long, don't you think? Yeah, I think uh, 49ers GM John Lynch, he's been doing this pretty smart because he saw, and I think we all saw, once Baker Mayfield got traded to the Carolina Panthers uh, from the Cleveland Browns for a conditional draft pick, either a fifth or fourth round pick, it was clear even if Jimmy G you know, was clear to be healthy before training camp or during training camp, he was not going to get a lot of value for him. The 49ers were not going to recoup, you know, anything like their investment unless a big event happened. You brought up an injury, you brought up, you know, something like that. And remember, how did Jimmy G end up in San Francisco? The 49ers and new head coach Kyle Shanahan were kind of struggling. They were looking for a, you know, potential franchise quarterback. So they traded with the New England Patriots. I believe it was a second round pick. Uh, back in the day. So again, that kind of opportunity does exist. And I think their patience will be rewarded here. Uh, just kind of waiting out that, you know, the fray and see who gets hurt as some teams look into, you know, either if they're a contending team and trying to stay in contention or, or a struggling team trying to just upgrade the quarterback room. Yeah, no. And I think this is a, like you said, a brilliant move by Lynch, but uh, Jimmy G can add a lot of value to a lot of teams. Uh, obviously the only teams that are left out there, they have questionable quarterback situations. Steam like they're gonna stick with those, uh, but there are a couple of teams who have young quarterbacks. That's who I would think is if one of these younger, more mobile quarterbacks goes down uh, due to injury, which could happen. That would be the best trade partner for a Jimmy G because uh, he could come in <clears throat> as a flyer for like a year or so. Uh, you get the value out of him, and then maybe you try to trade him after that, or you let him go off in free agency to see what he can get. But I think that would be a, a really interesting option there. Like you said, these uh, teams who've built around young guys and have like win now rosters would be the best option for Jimmy G because he seems to do best on a team that he doesn't have to carry the entire load on his back. He wants a lot of star players around him. Well, yeah, and especially you look at a guy in Jimmy G, you brought that up, is he's won a lot of games in the right situation. He took the 49ers to the Super Bowl. They had a fourth quarter lead against the Chiefs. You know, the fourth quarter lead against the uh, Los Angeles Rams in the NFC Championship game on the road last season. They, they beat Dallas and Dallas, beat Green Bay and Green Bay. So Jimmy G can win you games and can win you playoff games. And, and, and that's not something that needs to be disregarded. I mean, Jimmy G has more playoff wins than guys like Dak Prescott and Spades, guys like Lamar Jackson, Josh Allen. So, I mean, there is something to be said for Jimmy G's ability in the right situation to win playoff games. And there's a lot of teams in the NFL. You know, you look at Matt Ryan and the Colts, right? If Matt Ryan goes down the Colts, they're ready to win now. So Jimmy G would fit perfectly in there as an example. So there's a lot of opportunities uh, for Jimmy G to potentially end up at a team, like you said, if an injury occurs. And the 49ers, you know, to their credit, staying patient, playing slow, because when that moment uh, happens, and, and it does, we see big injuries every year, the 49ers will be ready. All right, Nick, it's time to get your internet privacy back today on every device you own in any country you want. 
Don't let anyone but you control your internet. NordVPN keeps you safe from prying eyes wherever you go online with their military-grade encryption. Is your favorite Netflix or streaming content blocked in the U.S.? You can simply connect to one of the many countries available with NordVPN and get the access you need. That's right, Maya. So right now, get our exclusive NordVPN deal here at nordvpn.com slash SMI. It's risk-free, risk-free now with Nord's, NordVPN's 30-day money-back guarantee. Again, get that exclusive deal, nordvpn.com slash SMI.